Sure, so I consider artificial intelligence to really augment the intelligence of humans. And I think that if, if done right, it's gonna be a big force multiplier on what people can accomplish. And I think that's fantastic. I'm here to talk about smart cities uh, and how AI is going to affect things like transportation. Uh, I think that uh, AI is, uh, I think, one of the few technologies that can really uh, transform what's been a very old, really antiquated system like our transit systems and our traffic systems. And I'm very excited about the fact that we're finally to the point where AI is going to move beyond Alexa and we're going to be seeing how it can really uh, affect um, what are going to be really big societal issues. I don't know if it is successful yet. Um, I think that if you uh, really look at it from the, the lens of public perception, we may not be there yet. Um, I personally am excited about how when we see AI meet what we all believe can be smart cities, uh, we're going to see what has been really kind of dumb distributed systems all of a sudden become interconnected and possibly for the first time really start to, to, to serve people in a brand new way. And I'm pretty excited about that. It's going to take a while, but it's interesting. So for me, it's, you know, it's really kind of a, a personal passion and curiosity more than it is kind of you know, my day job today. Um, you know, I'm advising companies that are looking at how AI is going to be impacting um, their markets um, and how they're going to adopt that and make that part of their business. Uh, I'm also you know, personally uh, really wondering when the trust gap is going to be bridged and how that's going to look when you talk about taking on really big problems out there. Um, right now, people are seeing this as a consumer issue or seeing it as a device issue for things like cars. When we start to get the things that are going to be having to uh, serve societies, um, serve whole cities, states, countries, um, that is a, a problem that we haven't even come close to approaching yet. And I think it's going to be very, very, very exciting. Well, Alexi's pretty cool. I don't know when the guy sleeps, but he's done an amazing job putting this thing on. Uh, I, I think that uh, seeing um, the talent um, that's both on stage and in the audience gives me a lot of hope um, that this is something that's going to be very real very soon. Uh, and perhaps you know a, a bit of that kind of productive impatience that we see uh, is going to really start to shine through, and we'll see some some really amazing things happen, not just in vehicle autonomy, uh, but also in in some of these larger ideas.